anybody can see that moving, that's not me. I'm not blowing on it. There we go. There we have it. Now you guys believe me? Now this one is like, where'd she go? Where's her body? I want to get in her skin. You know what I mean? Look at the, the thing. Yay! To see it? TikTok conspiracy theories. A seemingly endless source of entertainment. Whether it's somebody saying that the sun is actually a giant gumball, or that one day we will travel the alternate dimensions and meet the mantis people, it seems like there's always a new theory somewhere on TikTok. And that's exactly what I have for you guys today. At least a theory that is new to me. You see, I was browsing the internet, minding my own business, when I came across this TikTok talking talking about something called Morgellon fibers. Now, I had never heard of these fibers, and being the curious soul that I am, I looked into the video, and... Um, apparently Morgellon fibers are fibers from the chemtrails that fall from the skies and are sentient little worm-like lint things that are sent to spy on us by the government. No, I am not kidding. Now at first I thought this was just a video of somebody making up a theory, but then I started to look at the comments and there were dozens if not hundreds of people agreeing with this woman. And then I went on Google and YouTube and apparently this is like a whole thing that people think that there are these fibers falling from the sky that are sent to spy on us. Now, if you're anything like me, this is probably a see it to believe it kind of situation, so I'm just gonna show you. Let's begin. Please subscribe. Okay, I'm talking. Watch this thing move by itself. I'm not blowing on the thing, okay? I just found this on my couch. It's self-aware. It's moving. Look, look at the shit over my phone. Come here, little guy. All right, so just for a bit of reassurance, I'm going to ask you guys this, you know, just to make sure I'm still here. We're looking at a string, right? I mean, this is like a string that probably came off of, I don't know, like a sock. You know, like when you have a little pull on your sock and you pull it out and you accidentally end up ripping out like 80% of your sock. That's what this is, right? Right? Okay. Just, just making sure. Can you still see that? See, it's hard. I can't. It's very attracted to the metal. Look at this thing. It was so f***ed up. So f***ed up. It was just moving. We're here. I mean, you know what? I believe you. Air will do that to an almost weightless object. You put a string in the wind, you bet it's going to start moving. It doesn't mean it's a living thing. Dude, this was trying to get into my dog's paw. I found it on her Paw. If these were really like a government created life form, don't you think they'd be a bit more efficient? Do you really think that they would just allow themselves to be found? I doubt it. If anybody can see that moving, that's not me. I'm not blowing on it. This is a Morgan fiber, okay? It's on my pants. There we go. There we have it. Now you guys believe me? Um... I believe in static electricity. I do not believe that this thing is alive. I mean, like, what? what's even the logic here? Do I think that the government spies on us? Duh. I mean, obviously. But is this really how you think they're doing it? Like, let's just walk through this. Okay, so they hired a bunch of pilots to drop these worm lint strings onto the planet. And then I guess they just have to get lucky and so happen to fall into a house or something. Well, actually, no. No, never mind. They're alive. So I guess they just crawl crawl into your house, burrow into your dog's paw, and then what? Watch you watch TV all day? Watch you scroll on TikTok? And then exit your dog? And then do what? Crawl back to the Pentagon? I mean, what are they doing with this information? They have Wi-Fi built into them? This is likely the most inefficient way anybody could dream up that the government is spying on us. No, no, no. It's definitely not the phone that you put every aspect of your life into that you are filming this video with. No, it's the string people got it look it's self aware do you not see that is that not the creepiest thing you've ever seen look at i'm not blowing on it it's doing its thing you see that now you can see the difference it looks a lot like all the other hairs on my pants right 
But these things have, a t they, they're coarse, almost like a man's beard hair. Hey, uh, miss, a uh, real quick question. What color is your dog? It wouldn't happen to be white, would it? Do you have a white towel in your house that's ever been washed with these pants or dried with them? Maybe a white rug somewhere? A white sock? All of those things you think are less likely than it being a government spy string? Really? So just... Just look around. I encourage all of you. Okay, see that? I encourage all of you just to look at your clothes. Look at everything around you. They're everywhere. More videos and tests to come. Stay tuned. Ma'am, you can wiggle your finger at a dog hair all you want. You're not going to convince me that the string I find on my black sweater is a government drone. You have a better chance of making me believe that I'm a government drone than you do at making me believe this. Here's another one for all you f***s that think I'm crazy. Think I'm crazy now? Static electricity now? Look, now I'll see what it does with my finger. <gasps> oh my god. All right, did you? Okay. Did you not see that? It kind of struck me like a cobra. Jubilee for days, I don't think you're quite understanding that you are only strengthening the argument that this is just static electricity. Yeah, it's, it's attracted to your finger. I am very sorry to inform you, but it's not a cobra in string form. It's just, um, electromagnetism. This is not some sort of advanced bio-engineered sentient string species by the government. It is, once again, just a display display of static electricity. Oh my god. Okay, look what we have over here. This is really freaking me the f*** out. I'm supposed to be putting these pants on, but I'm not gonna do it. Let's see, I'll try to touch it a little, wake it up. not blowing on it. It's doing its thing. I'm not really worried about whether or not you're blowing on it. You're moving it around with your finger. Are you really under the impression that you are having no sort of influence on this string's movement? That's like me pushing somebody and when they get mad at me saying, oh, but I didn't blow on you. I've basically done nothing to you. Now this one is like, where'd she go? Where's her body? I want to get in her skin. You guys, is this a horror movie or what? Holy Lord. Well, it's a good thing I'm a Christian. Thank God I'm a believer. Because only God can help us, that's for sure. I'm just really struggling to understand here. Why would these strings want to get inside of our bodies? I mean, what are they going to gain from that? Are they going to make it into our brain or something? Wouldn't they be better off just observing us? Watching what we do day to day? I'm pretty sure the government somewhere already knows my blood type, so why would they want inside of my body? Probably don't even want to know what's coming next. Look at this thing. It's like got a cobra. You know what I mean? Look at the, the thing. Yay! Do you see it? Okay. Uh, yeah. All right. What would you guys do? <laughs> Questions, comments? Here we go. This thing's like going nuts over here. I clearly see I'm not blown into it. Guys, they're everywhere. Everywhere. Well, what I do, I would probably run to the Dollar Tree and buy a lint roller. I think I'd win this fight pretty quickly. So that's all of the videos on this person's channel. I looked through all the comments and stuff, and like I said, this is a genuine thing. And it's honestly kind of scary, the amount of people who believe this, not only in these comments, but all over the internet. And also, what do they say to do about it? You know, not buy a lint roller, not vacuum more than once a month. They're saying stuff like, take dewormer mint 
for dogs, which uh, if you didn't know, you should never do, ever. Okay, please don't ever do that. And just other crazy stuff like that, and it makes no sense. If the government was launching this super high-tech campaign where they're sending these string worms all across America, do you really think they'd allow them to be seen? And that their weakness would be canine heartworm medicine? It's scary that in 2022, people not only come up with this stuff, they get others to believe it. Well guys, what do you think? How many string people do you estimate are inside of your body right now? Some sources say over 20 million. Just to be safe, I think I've got a date with a lint roller tonight. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and walk on over to that subscribe button and touch it. It's free. It won't cost you anything. But for now, that's all I have for you today. Bye. Subscribe.